Trent, uh, go ahead and bring uh, Mr. Uh, Rosser in real quick. Is this your first book? This is my first book. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, he's here. He's got a, a, a great new book he's put out. It's called uh, Gunfight at Old Tascosa. Right. And it's down and deep into uh, the roots of who we are, uh, this part of the world. And uh, tell, tell, tell us what, what motivated you in this story. I've always wanted to write. And uh, I started watching some old westerns, and I came across uh, Young Guns. Um, Doc Scarlock was played by Keeper Sutherland, and in Young Guns 2, he was killed. I didn't know that. I thought that was real. Turns out it was not. Doc Scurlock moved to the Texas Panhandle, and I believe it's the 1880 census. He was the mail carrier for Potter County. Whoa! And exactly, that's exact my exact words. Whoa! What I didn't know anything. I lived here in my entire life. I didn't know anything about this. Right. And so I started doing more research. Found out Billy the Kid was here. Um, you know, he there at the boys' ranch. Yeah. Be a mm-hmm. town called Otesco. Right. Yeah. More research I've done. I found out after Billy the Kid was killed, Pat Garrett moved to this area and trained Texas Rangers. I didn't know that. Texas. Really? Yes, sir. Yes, wow. sir. That was all true. Wow. Now, there are some speculations. Some say Pat Garrett was only here for a few months. Some mm-hmm. say he was about here about a year. Um, I'm not sure on that. One person says one thing. One article says another. So I found out after... He trained these rangers, and he went off to pursue other opportunities. Some of these rangers got into a big, big gunfight mm-hmm. there at Old Tascosa. Uh, three rangers were killed. Wow. Uh, none of the other guys were killed, but it was three rangers. And at that time, it was more talked about than the gunfight at the OK Corral. Really? So it was more historically famous at that time? At that time, yes. Wow. And it is right down the road. Right. Right, down, right there at Boys Ranch. Wow. You know, uh, uh, go ahead, Chuck. You know, uh, I many, many moons ago, I used to uh, work with a group, Lone Star Shootists, and they used to always talk about the gunfight at Old Tascosa. But even then, I didn't even know that it would, that gunfight was that big. It, it kind of made uh, the gunfight at OK Corral look like kindergarten, didn't it? Wow. It, it did to a point. Yes. Three rangers killed. Three rangers were three out of the four rangers were killed, and there were many injuries on the other one. There was also a innocent bystander that was killed. Oh wow! Oh wow! Now, that innocent bystander was a gentleman by the name of Jesse Sheets. Now here's the interesting part that I found out doing this research. All these years, uh, they thought he was killed and shot in the head, mm-hmm. and early 1900s his family wanted to exhume the body right they exhumed the body they still he, he still had the bandage bandana around his head but there was no bullet hole in the skull wow so there was another theory that came out and that's all in the book oh cool so you got to get the book and, and you, he said wait a minute i'm gonna leave you on that clip back good job Trent. and and he's going to have a book signing uh september 2nd from 2 until 4 p.m uh it's going to be at auntie m's and Eeks. And Eeks. And Eeks uh, uh, Bookstore. That's on 6th uh, Street. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 2906. 6th right. Street. Come right on. Street from Smokey Joe's. You're going to be signing copies of it, talking about the book. And what was the most rewarding part of writing this book? Uh, the most rewarding part was it was actually two different things. Um, many years ago, I was in bad, bad shape. Yeah. I am a recovering alcoholic. In fact, I just celebrated my 14 Congratulations. years. Congrats. 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 Um, one of the things I want to do was make my family proud from what I've done. Mm-hmm. And my father found out, we was talking about cancer earlier, he had cancer. Oh, he man. beat it once, it came back, he beat it twice. Wow. But it tore his lungs up and right. he passed away just, uh, just last month. Oh, I hate to hear So that, that oh. was... He got to see the book. He got to see so the So that work. was the rewarding part. That's, that's, so. it's, it, it, I can't wait to read it. And, uh, it, you know, it, it's about us. It's about here. And yeah. that's really neat. And, uh, and, you, and, and on top of that, you've got to give a legacy to your dad. There you go. That's the coolest thing. Larry McMurtry, make- better watch out. I know it. Yeah, we're going to get a series. Yeah. Come check out Gunfight at Old Tascosa. 
Auntie Eek's books this Saturday, 2 to 4, down on 6th Street. You can meet the author, Trent Rosser. Uh, he'll be signing copies of the book for you and talking about it. A great, great book, Gunfight at Old Tascosa. Thank you for coming in, Trent. Really appreciate it, man. My pleasure. Good God. luck with My this. I hope, I hope it's a movie. Uh, that's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm saying. It needs to be a movie. Yeah. We're going to have to work on that. We're going to take a break. We're back with more chat right after this.